Out to our top local story tonight, a cruel and unnecessary act of vandalism is overshadowed by the response to that crime. A local lacrosse field was badly damaged, deep holes dug into the ground and equipment broken. But the community responded quickly, making sure the field was back in shape in time for a game tonight. Iowa News News reporter Jared Pliner is live in Westerly tonight with the South County Mobile Newsroom. Mike and Shannon, it was the lacrosse coach who came upon all this destruction this morning, but what's truly noteworthy is what happened next. Parents of eight and nine year old town lacrosse players unified in their disgust. It's just a real shame. And from the players themselves. Angry at people. Parents notified Friday morning that vandals had done this at Westerly's Bradford Preserve under the cover of darkness. I got an email, yeah. I got two emails. The field's lacrosse nets methodically slash beyond repair, holes dug by shovel in the soft turf. Parents disheartened that the destruction, at least temporarily, undercut the town league's message of integrity. Teaching the kids about sportsmanship and how to be a good teammate, and then for them to see something like this happen, it just, you know, it reinforces the negative. Worse yet, the kids had a Friday night game, and that's when the rallying cry went out. That they're going to bust their tails to get it done. People coming together, pooling donations to defray the repair costs. Just look for yourself at the end result. Healthy competition and smiles all around. And as for that ever important lesson, well, these kids learned about resilience. A couple of oh, holes in the ground and tearing up nets won't stop us from playing. You had your game regardless. Yeah. You had fun. Yes. So they didn't succeed in the end, I guess. No. And parents have expressed skepticism that the person or persons responsible for the vandalism will be found. Because of the remoteness of the area and the lack of witnesses, still Westerly police say they are working on it. Live in Westerly tonight with the South County Mobile Newsroom, I'm Jared Pleiter, Eyewitness News.